Hey beautiful Sagittarians, welcome back to the channel guys. I hope you're doing fabulous guys. Thank you for joining me. Thank you so much for all your likes, your contributions, your generosity. It's deeply appreciated, Sag, know that. Sagittarius. Hmm. Leo energy comes out. Leo, Scorpio, and Pisces. Someone was in their false ego. You're about to experience something very powerful and profound in your life. You'll be forever changed. Psychic sensitivity and subconscious is here. Focus and commit yourself to your spiritual growth and practice to be able to receive the gifts of the divine. What's going on? This could be the Leo... A uh, portal we're talking about. Mm. You're going to have to maintain awareness of yourself in your external environment at this time to measure the impact of influence. Let's see. Mm. Someone does not want you getting justice. Someone does thinks it's they don't want you receiving justice here, Sagittarius. They don't want you to enjoy. See, here is the grass was not greener. Okay? It was not greener. It, they were in their pride, their ego, and the grass was not greener. They think it's unfair that you receive justice. So be careful here, Sag. Yeah, so they tried to confuse you. They are connected to lower places, higher places, crossing the reed. These are lower vibrational energies, Sag. Be careful of who you surround yourself with at this time, particularly through the month of August. Someone may be trying to send you obstacles because what's this? Get ready to celebrate. A social event is on the horizon. This is star energy. If you think it through and act wisely, you'll come out on top. Use your mental power to navigate your path. This is clarity. Somebody tried to block your clarity. Uh, confuse you, Sagittarius. Try to... They think it's unfair that you are celebrating. They think it's not fair. Um, there, Somebody is trying to influence this, I don't know, they're lower vibrational energy, Sag. They're trying to lower your vibrations so you don't get this justice. And you see, you have the clarity. Sagittarian's own energy saying, I see. I see what they're doing. I see how they're trying to influence me. I see what they're trying to do here. This is a solid foundation. This is love. And this is desire. Scorpio energy. It's like they think it's, I told you, lower vibrational energy. I'm telling you. Again, Leo energy here. Somebody's trying to influence you, Sag. Now it's either this month of August 
you're going to get the truth and clarity about someone. And it could be about someone you love. It does not have to be a romantic love situation. But you see clearly. Someone's in their south node paying life debts here. And somehow they're thinking that they can use your influence or your abundance here, your celebration to get part of a fortune. I'm sorry. Somebody's trying to capitalize on you, Saj. Period. Let's go. They're a thief. Somebody could be actually going to jail. Somebody could be concerned about this transformation or this ending. Hmm. Change. Hmm. What the frick is this? Come on now. This is someone at a distant horizon who's in poverty. And they're thinking about courting you. This is a wealthy man in despair. Clarify this. Um, <laughs> I'm breathing really heavy here all of a sudden like anxiousness I feel really really anxious about something you you see clearly Saj this is wish fulfillment this is starseed energy you're very confident you're very um, abundant here you're out in your garden here tending to your own your own self your own healing your own abundance here and somebody does not want you to have this I'm sorry, they don't. Someone feels less than or they feel unworthy somehow because you are successful. I cannot. What the hell is this? The grass was not greener. There's a thief here. I'm I it hasn't come out yet, Sagittarius, but I feel this jealousy, I just feel this jealousy. It's because you are getting some kind of good news, Sagittarius. Yep, and you have moved on. You've taken a leadership position. You are focusing in on your own, tending to your own garden here. You are focusing in on a solid foundation. Uh, Sag, oh my God.
So someone is ashamed, embarrassed, or regretful here, Saj. Cancerian energy comes out. The chariot. I told you, you're building a solid foundation, Saj. And there is some kind of communication or, or, or communicating with you or sending your protected here now, Sagittarius, someone you're very close to. I don't know, Sag. They may have... Uh, I don't like it, Saj. You're celebrating a lot of growth. You're getting a lot of positive recognition and rewards here, Saj. I, I'm feeling anxious. I, I don't often feel this way, but I feel shaky. Like I feel really anxious about something. Someone could be in bad health. <sighs> I gotta calm down. Why am I getting like this? I never get like this. Like I feel a sense of anger, but I also feel a sense of like somebody is in bad health here. I knew it. Somebody's fucking jealous. Sag, they're not just jealous of you, Sagittarius. They're jealous of your immediate family. They are jealous of your Ten of Cups. They are jealous of you because you're paying attention to your family, because you're tending to your garden, because you are celebrating some kind of Maybe you got a new home, or maybe you're doing well, building a solid foundation. You've strengthening bonds here with your immediate family, and someone's fucking jealous. They're in a low vibrational energy, and somebody is, like, jealous because they feel... They're talking shit and they're lying about whatever they're talking about. They're spreading gossip and rumors and they are lying about what's spewing out of their mouth, Saj. And it could be, for some of you, your own family members. I, I, I'm, like, they may not be, like, your immediate family, like, your, um, they could be outside your immediate family, like, I'm not talking about you and your children or something like that, I'm talking about, like, extended family. There's also someone who has passed away, Sagittarius, in your immediate circle, in your immediate family who has passed over. And they are saying they don't want to see you do well. Do not. Uh, do not give these people. They're making fun of this person. <clears throat> they are.
talking shit about you and your family. They are. And they're lying their face off. They're a gossip and a rumor munger. I don't like it, Saj. They're trying to keep it so that you do not get your justice. This is transformation. They they don't want you transforming. They don't want you getting all of this, Saj. Jesus. And someone who has passed over, it could be a father figure or a masculine figure who has passed over, Sagittarius, is fighting hard for you to get your justice. They see what's going on. They hear what these people are doing. They see what these people are doing. You're getting blessings. Now look, you could have been someone's mentor. You could have been mentoring someone or you're coming off as this hierophant energy. Um, you could be getting a new promotion, a raise or new opportunities that are making you very stable. And this is your justice. And these people don't want to see you get this justice. And someone who has passed over is also fighting behind the scenes, telling me in this reading that they are trying to block your blessings. Confusion. Oh, oh my God. They're being controlled by some kind of negative entity or a negative force here, Sagittarius. They're in karmic energy. They're in south node energy. Okay? This could be greed. Fear. Trying to control you somehow, Sag. And this passed over loved one is trying to tell me in this read that they're trying to block your blessings, trying to keep you from getting this justice, trying to keep you from getting what is rightfully yours here. Jesus. They're doing some sort of manipulation. You've got someone looking out for you, Sag. See, they're trying to stop you. They're trying to create you obstacles. They're trying to bring you burdens. And this person who has passed over is saying, ignore them. Don't pay them any attention. Don't let them put you in a negative mindset. They are looking out for you, Sagittarius. They're competing with you and they're angry that you know the truth about them. Clarity. <sighs> act wisely, Saj. If you act wisely, you'll come out on top. Use your mental power to navigate this path. Someone is under judgment. Wheel of Fortune, you'll come out on top. See? Look. They're trying to cause you a tower. They're trying to block you. Block your intuition. Block your gifts. This could be some sort of celebration 
that is coming in for you, Sagittarius. And they are trying to block you. I'm sorry, but they are. You've got someone defending you. You've got... Because you're very wise. Look. You're very wise. You're in this sage energy. You're in this hierophant energy. Um, this is clarity. This is wisdom. This is knowledge, Sagittarius, the high priestess. This is someone very wise, very intelligent, very intellectual. He's trying to defend you. Look, Sag. Hang on. Sagittarius. I told you, haters are lying about you. They're lying. They hate you because of your blessings. They even now are hating some of your family members because you're, of course, when you do well, your family members are doing well. You know what I mean? They have evil intentions. And I don't even know if they actually mean it or it's just the way they are. gonna gaslight you they're jealous and competing with you My fuck. that's exactly what the tarot said I'm trying to gang stalk you it's like they're trying to lower your vibrations trying to lower your self esteem Sagittarius Please do not believe these people. Know that they're doing this um, either intentionally or unintentionally. It does not matter. Protect your energy because they don't want to see you celebrate. They don't. And then they play the victim once they know that they're losing. So it's like they're trying to turn the tables on you, Sagittarius. They're trying to make it look like, um, you know, you think you're better than other people, Sagittarius. Well, look, look, you don't get along with anybody, Sagittarius. You, you know, I'm better than you. I'm, who do you get along with? Who do you get along with, Sag? I mean, you're hermiting. So they're looking at that hermit energy as, well, you know, who is Sagittarius? They're a hermit. Who is Sagittarius? No, they're freaking wise. That's what they are. They might be calling you a recluse. They might be trying to lower your self-esteem like maybe they won't figure that because you're getting this... They're making fun of you. Sagittarius is a hermit. Sagittarius, you know, they might have this and they might have that, but they're finding all the negative things about you, trying to point out all your flaws and pointing out all your flaws, but they're lies. They have to lie about it. And I'm sorry, but some of these people are in your indirect family. Like, they don't live under your roof. They don't, they're not, these are not your children, okay? These are outsiders. These are people who are not in your immediate household or family who you would consider as in your immediate circle. These are people who are on the outside of the circle. You keep your circle small, Sagittarius. It's you're a hermit. Give me a break. You're wise. That doesn't mean you don't associate with people. It doesn't mean you don't have fun and talk to people. It doesn't mean you don't have a friend circle. It means you're very choosy about who you allow into your friend circle. 
and it's looking like you keep your friend circle small, your true friend circle. It's like they want to steal your thunder. They want to steal your victory. They want to steal your success. They want to steal your energy. They want to deplete you of your energy. They want to set you up obstacles and challenges. And they want to make it look like you are a problem when you're minding your own damn business. It's actually them who are doing that whatever they're saying about you Sagittarius and this sounds cliche but it's actually them who has a problem getting along with people it's actually them who has the issue about okay so I'm going to make some shit up here because they're coming out of a, a south node low vibrational energy they're pissed off that you're winning they're pissed off you're succeeding they're pissed off that you're content on your own. They're pissed off that you're alone doing better than what they are. They envy your skills and talents. They are jealous and in competition with you, Saj. So, of course, they're going to try and lower your uh, your value. They may even try to make you cry, make you feel bad about yourself, pick on you, like gang up on you to lower your self-esteem. And someone is doing white magic on you to protect you, and that is your past over loved one. It is. It's a masculine figure. It could be a father. It could be a grandfather. It could be a brother. It could be a son. Uh, a male energy is white lighting you and protecting you because they know damned well what these characters are up to. It's like they want to cause you a tower. It's like, you know, we're all having a good time here. And then the other foot drops. It's done deliberately to suck your energy. It's done deliberately to lower your vibration. It's done deliberately. I don't even know if they're aware that they're doing it. Okay? But the truth is they're jealous. And the truth is, is that they're in very low vibrational energy. There, that being said, I feel better. My God, was I ever uptight about that. So I know the energy that they're in is making you feel pissed off and it's making you feel like who the hell do they think they are i'm over here minding my own damn freaking business i'm not bothering anybody i'm in high vibrational energy and i'm not disturbing anybody you're not you're a hermit who could who the hell could you be disturbing you're a hermit and you're wise to be a hermit at this time your social circle is very, very limited right now, Sagittarius, because of these energies. Like, you get along with people, Sagittarius. You're a lot of fun. You're outgoing. You're funny. You're gregarious. You're excited to, you know, about your life, excited about the things you're accomplishing in your life, achieving your goals. They can't stand it to celebrate you. They just can't stand celebrating your successes. <laughs> They're ganging up on you. Plotting and scheming is part of their lifestyle and their hobby. Why? Why? 
Why? Because they're bored in their own lives. You're over here busy working. You're over here tending to your own garden. You're over here, maybe you purchased a new home. Maybe you're having, celebrating shit, good things going on in your life, Sagittarius, and they hate it. They fucking hate it. I cannot stand people like this. And yeah, and then they look to pick a fight with you. Looking to pick a fight with you. They're salty because you're not paying them any attention. You're not falling into maybe before when you were younger. This could even be your siblings. I'm just telling you right up. They're looking to pick a fight with you. To lower your vibrational energy. It's like they can't stand the fact that you are achieving. They can't stand the fact that you are celebrating. That you're doing good for yourself and you're doing it alone. Now, that could have been your past soulmate as well. Like... They're gang stalking you. It's like they're trying to find fault in you. They're trying to find anything to rip you down. They're trying to go out of their way to bring you down, Saj. Oh my God, you might have to get that sword out again. Trying to see what I'm saying? They try to one up you and they're trying to pick a fight with you to make you to bring you down, to make you depressed, to make you oh you think you're something Sagittarius, and Sagittarius is minding their sweet effing business. I don't know what you're gonna do, Sagittarius. They fake support you. Like they pretend, oh yeah, congratulations, Sagittarius. And then they turn around with the double-edged sword and cut you down. I cannot stand people like this. I hate people like this. I'm sorry, I hate their energy. I gotta get out of here. I can't stand it. I, I'm feeling all worked up. I'm feeling like angry i'm feeling like why can't people just come into your life and give you the pat on the back that you deserve and say congratulations sagittarius you've been through a lot you've been through the most and i'm sure proud of you i'm sure glad you're doing well i'm very and leave it at that and actually be honestly happy for you but they can't They cannot. So maybe why this is coming out, Sagittarius, is because we are in the Lion's Gate portal where the veil is thin and all those little hidden enemies, trickster energies are all coming out, being exposed. Jesus, I don't know how much smaller your circle can get. People being impressed because you're receiving happiness. Depressed because you're receiving happiness. They're sneaky. Trying to bring you burdens. I'm telling you. Playing the victim. Poor me. And anybody knows or should know 
You cannot manifest when you're in victim mentality. Broke likes broke. Poor likes poor. I'm sorry. These people can't stand you winning. Like you might be the first in your family to achieve a major accomplishment. Or it's just a personal achievement for you, Saj. And they cannot be happy for you. They'll fake. Oh yeah, we're all behind you. And then behind your back, they knife you. They're looking for any fault. They're looking for any flaw. Well, come on in and have a look. Because we all got them. Sagittarius has faults. But you're not picking on theirs. You're minding tending your own garden. You're not fault finding. You ain't pointing the finger at their lives. You ain't pointing the finger at them and fault finding them. But they sure got the fingers out toward you. So it's like, and then they get other people on their side so that you can look really bad and they can sit and have a good talk about you and carry on about you because they're fucking bored in their own life. And I'm sorry, Sag, they are. I'm sorry that people are doing this to you. You deserve it, Sagittarius. You've worked hard for this. This is stuff that has never fallen into your lap. And finally, you get a little freaking window of an opportunity and somebody gonna try and take it from you i tell him to kiss my ass i don't care if they're lovers family members friends couldn't care less a true friend will be happy for you and i don't care who they are It's like sabotage. It is. And some people do it intentionally and other people do it unintentionally. Sagittarius, I'm sorry. It's like... <sighs> Get ready to celebrate, Sag. Because there's, I, I don't know, it's almost like Spirit is saying, the more these people try to do to you, the more they're go you're going to be blessed. The more they try to sabotage you, the more blessings will be coming to you. And for longer periods of time. I'm real sensitive to stuff like this, guys. Like, I, I, I actually, I am an empath, but I actually feel the energy. I felt my blood pressure rising. I got so angry, and I never do that. I never do it. Very rare, very seldom. I'm not saying never, never. But it's very few and far between I get worked up about something like this. Because I know darn well how hard you have worked to achieve whatever you're working to achieve. I don't care who these people are. If they can't celebrate your wins. But then they sure are there to celebrate your downfalls. You don't need them in your life. And it makes it difficult, to, especially if they are people in, you know, that you care about. But oh well. They're creating their own downfalls by doing that. Like, they don't get it. They're creating their own towers by doing, being in that mindset. And then they play the victim. You know what I mean? Like, oh, we never get that. Well, what are they doing about it? Do they want to work how Sagittarius is working? Do they want to be devout and loyal and dedicated and committed to doing this? Nope. But they just want to talk about it, Sag. They're, it's an illusion. It's a freaking illusion. The portal is open for you, okay? 
and you could be getting a lot of messages. This is happening in the distant future, Sag. It's not what's already occurred. It's in the distant future. I'm really sorry that this is happening to you. I, I, I am. Sorry. That's all I can tell you. Looking to pick a fight with you, Satch. Gang stalking. Looking to pick a fight with you just to suck the celebration out of you. Burden you. jealousies are creating their own towers. Like they're projecting onto you, Saj. They are. They're secretly wishing that you would have a tower. They don't want to see you celebrate, Saj. It's their ego. in their nose where it don't belong. Someone very judgmental and very critical. This could be someone very cynical. You know, has a pessimistic outlook toward life. Instead of an optimist, they're a pessimist. Instead of seeing what's good in this situation, they fault find. And then they whine the loudest when their own lives turn out to be miserable. Take care, Saj.